You have been convicted of a crime you did not want to commit. A crime of the highest degree. You have been exiled from your brethren and left to rot with the lowest of the low. In this place, there is no redemption. You are the base denominator of all, only to be taken from your cell in the most extreme of circumstances. You have no friends, no family. This is your prison. This is your home. This is your fate. Welcome to Dice Jail. Last time on Life of Dice Jail, the party returned, got lights, and did a bit of shopping in Otari. We bought some stuff in Rins. We have uh, basically, yeah, that's literally what we did. We just bought some stuff in Rins. We went to the Crook's Nook for a bit. Uh, Oberyn and Nyx pulled off a nice little scam, making a whole 40 gold, by the way, which is like yeah, a yeah. month's salary. <laughs> Uh, and subsequently, we all went back uh, to Godlight after resting up and healing up and getting lunch and some and you know going down to the cave where you defeated the Drake and those uh, Pylocks. What is it called? Morlock. Morlock. Morlocks. 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 And also got just jump scared by one. And last we left off, Cam just told us to roll for fucking initiative. Yeah. So, you know that's so happening. Here we go. Popping straight into the action. Though I will say, we really quickly need a, need a little bit of a Remy update. Uh, Mr. Raddington, you, after getting yourself patched up by Rin, uh, you purchased some more ammo, which I should specify. At this point, uh, you have no more cartridge ammo. So Rin sold you a powder horn full of gunpowder and a bag of ball bearings and told you to have fun. Oh so, my goodness, Rin now, has made a mistake. <laughs> you have followed, and I would say at this specific moment in time, you are right over here uh, in the tunnel on the way towards the room where you blew that dude's head off. Also, and, I don't know um, why, but but Foundry is very laggy for me right now. It's... That's because you got a laptop and you're opening Discord the same. No, way. this no, this is on my this is on my brother's PC. Oh, it's okay. probably just something weird with the lighting effects. It does that sometimes. Um, but you would, I, I would say you would probably have heard, would one of you have made a made a bit of a noise when the Morlock jump scared you? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. All Possibly. Right. So wait, wait, say, wait, 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 no, 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 wait, wait, wait. Let me roll a fortitude save to see if I scream like a <laughs> we'll little save. fucking girl. We'll save. We'll save. Oh, we'll save. Okay, okay. A will save. Yes. Sorry. It's okay. Oh, ah! Just What'd normal manly. Uh, Just 22. a normal Just manly a normal, scream. A manly scream. <laughs> Remy, you hear a normal manly scream from up ahead in the darkness. What's that? So. I hear a I hear a normal manly scream coming in the darkness <laughs> ahead. I must hurry. So. Everyone, go ahead and where roll I am. for your initiative. You're in the dark right now. Actually, Remy, would you have lit a torch? 
Uh, yeah, yeah, All I right. would have lit a torch. There no, Cameron, I wouldn't have lit a Petra. torch. <laughs> Here we are at the start of the encounter. Petra is up first, but right before we get to that, as Jason is holding a torch, the Morlock is exposed <laughs> to bright light, which blinds it. Damn. Um... I so, just I, I, I just opened up a Redditor's uh, basement <laughs> cave. <laughs> it is currently blinded until the end of its next turn. Um, now, as of last as of uh, last time, I've realized that I was using blindness wrong. So blindness, uh, so blindness in this case means that it is flat-footed to all of you. Um, and it needs to make a DC 11 flat check when targeting anything hidden from it with an attack spell or other effect. Um, so basically all that means right now is that it is flat footed to you. So Petra, you're up first. Wonderful. I uh, wonderful. I'd like to tumble through and get over all here. Right, go ahead and make an acrobatics check. It would help if I pulled my character sheet up. Probably. I got so distracted by Jacob that I forgot that I needed, <laughs> you know, <laughs> by my By my insane antics of microphones. I'm so curious as to what I sound like right now. Okay, Do that's a 20. That badly a like 20. Kobe? Unfortunately, Petra, right as you go to whoo, roll past this thing, it just sort of wildly flails its club hand into the wall and you have to stop short right there. Well, that's bad. Um. Okay, I will cast Guidance on my buddy Jason. Alright. He's just oh, wow. right there. Jason I've upgraded guidance. from adversary to buddy. Well, <laughs> we'll see. So you have one action remaining. Um, I'm gonna hold it, and if you the uh, wait, no, you can hold it right as your reaction. Yes. Yeah. If I uh, this bloke right here comes out of the room, I would like to I try and stab him. Okay. I will say it. It just has cover right now. You are capable oh, it just of has cover right now? Yeah, it has it has a it has standard cover, so it's a plus two to its AC, which is nullified due to it being flat footed. Okay, see, I was thinking because of the angle I was at, I couldn't stab it without stabbing Jason. No, you've got it's got cover. It's got cover. I mean if you roll really poorly, then who knows what'll happen, but Don't say that camp. I don't like Jason that much anyway. <laughs> okay, I'll try and stab him. Go for it, Chief. Okay, team. that's a 15. 15 just barely hits due to the flat-footed. Go ahead and roll damage. Ooh. Wonderful. That's six points of damage. Six points of damage as you give it a stab with your rapier. All right, then. That brings us to Mr. Remy Rattington. Can you guys hear that. me? Sorry. Yes. All right. Cool. Um. Shit. My mom. Uh, oh, sorry. Second. I'm just gonna. I'm um, just gonna run. Okay. You do that, Petra. You notice another Morlock in the room. So it's one stride to move to where you currently are. Second stride to move over there. To move. Hold on. I need. You're trying to go through a wall right now. There you go. Uh, oh God. There Give you me one second. Oh. There's Jacob's mom. <laughs> I don't want to call him when he comes back. <laughs> Random encounter. Jacob's mother. Yeah, Jacob's mother. 2,500 XP. I don't assume she listens to this podcast, but to be clear, if she does, we don't want to murder her. <laughs> no. This is true. 
And also for all of the law this. enforcement listening in, we do not <laughs> want to murder her. Yeah, FYI. Just if something should happen and there is an investigation, I just want it on record. <laughs> I need. I, I hope Jacob still has headphones on right now so that he can hear me I say that I'm definitely so keeping sorry this about in that. the podcast. Hey, yeah. Jakey! No! Jakey! <laughs> Hi, Jakey Poo! Oh, Jakey's back! I'm gonna back. kill you. Yeah. I'm gonna kill you. That's my second stride. And, and then my third back. action, I'm gonna, I'm gonna kill. I'm gonna shoot him. Okay, I oh will say God, it, I does, you all. it does have quite a bit of cover right now from your allies. Oh, does that... What, are you gonna shoot fucking Jason and then just shoot it? <laughs> if you want yeah, to go gonna, for it, gonna, go for it. I'm gonna shoot through Jason <laughs> okay. for for playing along the Jakey Poo thing. Roll yeah. to hit. <laughs> um. Oh, Jakey, you wouldn't shoot your friend, <laughs> would you? I'm gonna f I'm gonna end you. I'm gonna make sure that this goes <laughs> right through the skull. <laughs> um. No, I'm not gonna shoot at him. I'm just gonna shoot. I know. I'm gonna attempt Roll to hit. shoot past him, <laughs> but I'm gonna be very lackluster on this. I'm trying to find. <laughs> He's not trying too hard to aim. <laughs> yeah, where's my? I need. To, I need to find where this is. Right. Okay. What did I? Oh, a twenty-two. Twenty-two. Oh yeah, that's a very much a hit. As all of you have the have your backs to the door right now. And just suddenly you'll hear BANG! As a gunshot goes off, the bullet whizzes past. Jacob, roll damage. Two. Two points of damage. The, this bullet just BOOM! Grazes the Morlock's uh, shoulder as it reels back. You all turn around and see Grandpa suddenly there. That brings us to Nyx. Okay. So he has cover, but is there yes. like enough room for me to attack? He has greater or... cover right now. So you can attack, uh, but it has a substantial bonus to its AC. Okay. Now, can I stop mid-turn in someone else's space or can I move through its space? You can try to tumble through its space. Okay. I will which look. is, uh, which includes movement. So you take a stride. And then you make an athletics check against, or ac acrobatics check against its reflex DC. Okay, I'm not super great at that. Those. I wanted to shove him, but there's no room. I guess I'll just try to tumble through. Okay. Go ahead and roll an acrobatics check then. Not terrible. 17? 17, unfortunately, is not enough. As you attempt, as you get ready to start trying to go through, you just realize that Petra and Jason are both moving way too much for you to get a clear uh, path. Okay, then I will just try to exploit vulnerabilities. Alright, go ahead. No, that's. 11. <laughs> 11. Not great. Um, unfortunately, that would not be a success. Um, well, this turn is going real good. <laughs> I, no. One action remaining. Can't move closer. I can't exploit vulnerabilities. I'm just going to swing madly All with right. my weapon. Go ahead and roll to hit. Oh, oh. That is a 26. 26. That is, in fact, a hit. Yay! That's seven points of damage. Seven points of damage. Oh, yeah. The Morlock <laughs> reels back in pain as Nyx's blade <laughs> slices into it. All right. That brings us now to the other Morlock, who Petra, you can see um, down in the corner, just keeping his head out of the light. Um, you watch as he disappears from view. That's probably not great.
is now <laughs> going to leap attack as it suddenly is behind Remy. <gasps> Wait, what? <laughs> Spooky. Fast. Yeah, oh my I god. I could have told Aliens you that might happen. <laughs> <laughs> All right. um, it attempts to already. bite Remy. Uh, that is a... Reflex save? No, you don't make any saves. It is attacking you. Just you. die. Uh, <laughs> that is a 15 to hit. No. All right. Then, Remy, you're just shocked as there is suddenly a Morlock directly behind you. But he is actually blinded by your torch. Does um, Remy scream like a girl? Probably. I don't know, <laughs> Remy. <laughs> yes, Remy screams like a girl. Um, so, it is now blinded uh, by the torch. Um, and that lasts until the end of its next turn, meaning it is now off guard. Oh. That brings us to Jason. Uh, Jason's, uh, goodness gracious. It takes an action to drop and draw something, right? Two actions to drop and draw something. Uh, it is a free action to drop. It is an action to draw. Unless oh, it's in your shoot. backpack. If it's in your backpack, it's two actions to draw. Shoot, I will drop my torch as okay. a free action and I'm going to off my bandolier. I'm going to draw my dueling dagger. All right. All right. And I got two more actions left and you know what I'm going to do it from yeah. so double slice. Double slice. All right. Let's do the dagger first because I don't No, well, actually let's rape your first because I, I always trust the first roll of the night. All right. Oh, natural 20. Natural 20. <laughs> oh, Hot damn, God. we're coming in strong. All right, let me deal you a crit hit All card. Right. Thank deal. you. All right. Random two. Yono. All right, you nice. have gotten card number three. That was three. a slashing or piercing attack? That's uh, a piercing attack. Piercing, Great so you got hand wound. Crit effect, until healed, the target is clumsy to and can't use one of his hands, determined randomly <laughs> All right. by the GM. All right. All right. So, that means that I now need to give this Morlock uh, clumsy to... Um, oh my god, this is a brutal card. This is an evil card right here. Most of the crit cards are, like, absolutely oh. brutal. The target um, skull crush. The target is stupidified free <laughs> until you heal. You just give him like a concussion. Oh literally. my god! Yeah. Uh, and you let's give see. them brain damage. <laughs> yeah, literally. Oh god. Heads his okay. left hand, tails his right hand. It has lost its left hand, which, according to the image directly in front of me, is its club hand. Oh fuck! So <laughs> no. Uh, it actually you actually just well. Go ahead and uh, did you roll both of your attacks or just the one? Uh, I gotta roll the other. I gotta roll the right, roll that dagger. and then go ahead and roll all your damage. All right, daggers. Oh, it's another fucking natural twenty. No way. No I'm, way. I'm, I'm, I'm gonna send a way. picture. I gotta send no you a picture way. right now. Hold on. This is obscene. Oh my no god. Fucking. <laughs> I'm, I'm fucked, guys. I, I, I'm gonna stop playing now. <laughs> Grab my phone and do this. Oh, it's it's so scuffed, but whatever. No fucking. Uh, it's two natural twenty. <laughs> oh my god, dude. <laughs> well, oh you've gotten god. card number fourteen, and that was All with right. a dagger. <laughs> so is this piercing or slashing? You can choose. Uh, leave. I'll take slashing for this one. All right, you got flay. Familiar. Normal damage. The target is enfeebled three until healed. <laughs> so deal double damage for your rapier and normal damage. Wait, hold on. Dagger. Wait, what the fuck's fifth beaver? What? <laughs> what? Oh. It says if I got piercing, but I'm not gonna do piercing. But I uh, never mind. I'm not gonna do piercing, oh, but it's a filth fever, right? Part. It's a disease. Yeah. Filth fever. Okay, no, but I'm doing I'm doing play. So okay. Um, let's see. So and first it's enfeebled one... three. This poor Morlock is just <laughs> being beaten to hell. All right. Uh, real quick, I know this is a critical strike for rapier. I. I want to make sure as double damage, right? It, it okay. You get double damage for your rapier and normal damage for your dagger. Okay, does it have, like, critical thing? Like, critical... No. 
Okay, just a no. critical. Critical deadly effects D8 are. Deadly D8 or whatever. Oh, wait, no, no. Deadly D8, that is with your rapier. So, yes. Yeah, okay. You roll an additional D8 on top right. of you your would, regular damage. Screw it. I'll just let the. I'll let Foundry roll my dice for this one because it has all the stuff here. It has, does the math for me. Uh, yes. There's 21 points of damage. Holy shit. From the rapier. Um. Yeah. Uh, okay, and then the uh, and then the dagger, which is it's just normal damage, right? Yep, normal damage. All right, normal damage. That's just a straight up one d four plus d six for sneak attack. Uh, it's nine points you, of damage, so thirty yeah, points of damage. You just absolutely just <laughs> rail this thing into the ground. <laughs> That Morlock is so uh, okay. like it never even had a chance to get the blindness out of its eyes. It is so unbelievably dead. Oh my gosh. Um Okay. So that's the end of Jason's turn. Uh, that all brings right. us to Oberyn. Oh boy. Alright. Um I'm going to move over to the left here. Uh, and then Christ. aiming over grandpa rat all right i'm gonna <laughs> don't you dare <laughs> dare 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 uh Dude. i'm going to go ahead and lob a ball of fire right all on that guy right. go ahead and hey, remind me again hit. uh grandpa rat uh what kind of ammunition did he use is it like use if he explosive or is it like an air rifle no it's explosive it's, it's yeah black powder. Oh, good it's, it's good to yeah, know that we're powder. throwing fire at him <laughs> Yeah, oh, yeah, perfect. Yeah. <laughs> because uh, that is a 24. A 24. Oh, yeah, that's a hit. Go ahead and roll damage. Damn, damn right it is. Six points of fire damage. Six points of fire damage. All right. And I believe that is your turn. That is my turn. All right. As the Morlock <laughs> reels back, that brings us to Petra. Okay. Um... All right, I'm gonna try and. Can I go up and tumble through this All gentleman right, go ahead to get and make over an here? Acrobatics check. If it will let me do any of the things that I need to do, instead of telling me I'm in a wall. Okay, that is twenty-four. Twenty-four is a success. Go ahead and move yourself to your desired location. Okay gonna make me do the thing where i have to do that okay and that gives me panache right yes it does so i would love to stab the gentleman with my finisher please go for it okay that is a 25 to hit a 25 to hit that not only hits but crits due to it being oh flat-footed God. so go ahead and roll critical damage which uh, you're using a rapier correct yes means that you are rolling double damage in plus a d8 plus your doubled panache damage okay so i'm doubling the damage for my finisher or i'm doubling the dice for my finisher you're doubling the damage you we don't double dice we double damage so yeah, you're. Yeah, you're doubling All right. damage. <laughs> so, that's so seventeen that's... from the rapier, and twenty-two from the. Twenty-two. Panache. So seventeen plus twenty-two <laughs> is thirty-nine points of damage. Holy shit, dude! That's a. <laughs> How do you want to do this? <laughs> um, can I decapitate him? Oh hell yeah! Petra, you just roll between Grandpa and this thing, just deftly sweep out on the other side, and you, Grandpa, you watch, you get your gun ready to shoot, but the Morlock isn't moving as its head just slides from its shoulders and plops on the I, floor. I love how we're just, like, sticking with calling me Grandpa at this point. <laughs> Guys, you're out of initiative already. Oh, um, no. Uh, everyone who is not named Petra Palmer gets 80 XP. Petra, you get 40. Fair. Damn, guys. 
<laughs> oh my god. Wow. Y'all killed we them. We just ended hard. that. <laughs> Y'all killed <gasps> them hard. Oh, good job. God damn. All right. Everyone good? Yeah, go team. Yes. All right. High five. Anyone? Come on. Carry forward. <laughs> Yeah, all right. Yeah, let's let's get Yeah, going. let's go. All keep right. Going. All right, and boy and emboldened by such an encounter, we shall <laughs> I will I Jason will uh will 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 put the dagger back and pick up the torch from the ground. All right. I'll have it. How do I pick stuff off the ground? I've already put it back to carried. Um all right, thank you. So you should just be able to set it to held one hand. Do you want to else take point, or should I do it? Because I feel like just, just. If you're just, too scared, just, I can do accept it. Accept your fate. Accept your fate. Yeah, accept your yeah. Fate. I know. Accept I know. I, I, I'm asking that because I, Jason's right now is trying to struggle to reignite the. No, torch. no, 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 no. Just, just it's like accept your fate. Accept your fate. Yeah, I, I can't accept, accept my fate right now because I'm, 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 I'm regularly. Uh, Where did the torch go? It boundary. was in your inventory a second ago. Where did it go? I know. <laughs> That's what I'm saying. What did you it's do? Summer. What did you? I do? ate it. Jason, it sounds like you're on point. As so, I'm on point, yes. My torch is lit. Thank as you. As you walk into this next room, uh, you find a desk with a chair in the center. Mm -hmm. um, and there's three empty picture frames hanging on the walls. On okay. the desk, uh, there appears to be some sort of clockwork device. Um, and... Uh, yeah, you're you're not really quite clear on what it might have done. It looks like the Morlocks did a number on it, trying to get it working. Ah. But um, yeah, there is a clockwork device on the table. Um, and I would say, you know, I would you know say <laughs> that uh, you'd spot uh, a specific shiny-looking gear poking out of the top. I will also note there's a door here and an open door here leading into a okay. uh, room that you can see by the illumination of your torch appears to be a wash room. Sorry, what yeah. were you asking me about? Uh, do you want to check out that uh, that broken clock device? Because you're good if you're good with the crafting, you might know what it is. Sure, I can take a look. Petra, you walk in, you take a look at it, and... Um, this is definitely not the kind of crafting you're familiar with. So you're a little bit out of your element here. Um, but uh, you would spot the same very intricate and shiny looking gear that uh, Jason did. It's just one gear? It's like very... One notable gear. Can I try the... winding it? Um, you attempt to wind it, but, you know, there's no real wind-up spot that you can see. Like I said, the Morlocks appear to have done quite the number on it. Okay. Really, I'm all gonna... that's left is the parts. I'm gonna sweep them into, like, a pile and just, like, put it in a little pouch on my belt. It's bigger than that. It's like, uh, oh, it takes up the entire desk. Oh, okay. Like you get the feeling like this a... thing was around the size of a small dog when it oh, was shit. fully assembled. Um, uh, like right now, it's just sort of like its inner workings have been exposed. It looks like a bunch of pieces have been taken off. Like basically, its outer shell has been removed, and now it's just the innards that are even mildly intact. Well, that's uncomfortable. Very much so. Yummy. So what would you like to do? Uh... I guess we should open this door. Remy, are you taking point now? Nope. 
That's what I thought. Uh, Fuck okay, no. Relax. Relax. All right, if I'm okay, if I'm taking point, then I'd rather have a dagger out just in case. If you guys don't mind. Okay. We do mind. Fuck you. <laughs> oh, I love you too, Petra. They shouldn't die. So. All right, I'm going to stop wearing my torch. Okay. Stow my torch away. All right. And then I'm going to open the door. All right. Jason. It's gonna be, can someone with a torch stand behind me? Petra Just, is like, right yeah. next to you. Yeah, but I want to see into the room. Yeah, me and Petra both have torches on, and, we can, and we're both right next to you. No, but, but the lighting. It's the lighting. I want to All see right. into the so, room. Jason. As Petra oh, the this is the fuck there you, Cam. Six doors on fuck you. Three on either side. There also appears to be just some area beyond this hallway that you think expands outward, but the torch does not illuminate that far. What would you like to do? I'm gonna walk in, but check for traps. Okay. Take a step in and see very second. slowly. Check for traps, like trip wires, arcane seals. You, as you step forward and into this, chickens. into this next space, you stop almost immediately because you hear something. You don't notice any traps. You don't notice any trip wires or anything. You hear ahead, wherever this hallway leads, you hear snarling voices. You are not alone in this space. Uh oh. I turn around. Everyone goes shh, like quiet, like finger over my lips, and I whisper as softly as possible. We're not alone in this space. Do you think they want cake? <laughs> he says at full volume. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, I'm turning my gate up for this. You no. think they want cake? <laughs> I guess Remy just volunteered to point on this. <laughs> just like pick him up by the scruff of his neck and throw him down the hallway, close the door. <laughs> yeah. Please tell me you're actually doing this. Please. I Jason will just literally like if, if does actually <laughs> Does Jakey make his uh, character say that? <laughs> I'm gonna out loud? fucking end you. Oh, I would oh say he God. did. I would say he already did. All right. In that case, Jason's gonna step back, very softly, close the door. Can I roll a reflex save for this? <laughs> and he's just gonna stare at. <laughs> he's gonna stare at Revy. It's like, if you want to take point, please. I'm going to dramatically gesture at the door. Yes, all right, I we all dramatically gesture. You know what? Fuck it, bat. All right, I'm doing this. <laughs> he opens the door. We his torch, today, boys. His torch still lit, as he says. We're dying today, boys, at full volume, and <laughs> marches into the hallway. All right. <laughs> I'm like Jason. a fifty-year-old rat. I've 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 had my time. <laughs> So, Remy, you are now currently in this space. All right, cool. So we're gonna we're gonna walk up here, right? We're gonna walk up here, and then we're gonna we're gonna we're gonna open this door. All right. This door. You open that door. Can I do that? Yeah. You open the door. Inside, There's you see an old in this door. An old, shattered bed frame. But that cool. appears to be all. There's nothing in there, guys. <laughs> this is some shit that's gonna be like, oh, is this either gonna be like right in the middle or right at the end? All right. There's also Again, a shattered, bed, a shattered frame. bed frame. I'm noticing a pattern. <laughs> okay. I'm gonna open up this door. Once again, shattered bed frame. I. Yup. There's this next room something... has a much more thoroughly shattered bed frame, as well as a nightstand. Real quick. Okay. Is there like a drawer Jesus. in the nightstand? No. All drawers have been removed, and it looks like their pieces are scattered throughout. Interesting. OK. 
Okie dokie then. <laughs> I love how... <laughs> I think this is the only time that I've ever seen us ever move neatly single <laughs> file. <laughs> yeah, what the hell? <laughs> all it took was a hallway. Yeah, all it took was a hallway. Turning cats in a hallway. And a stupidest amount of fear. Check? Um... I roll stealth checks for you, but yeah, if you would I, like to move quietly, <laughs> if you would yes. like to move quiet, then yes, you can. We can say you're only moving Jason will try and move quietly in this unit, but yes, Jason. Okay, the, I'm opening this next door. As quiet as you can be, Remy and Petra's torches alone make it difficult to be stealthy, but Remy just sort of hobbling down, slapping his rat feet against the stone pavers and just sort of <laughs> slamming the doors not a open. Not care in the just world. Just not a single shit given. Um, yeah, you're, you get the feeling that no matter what you do, too much attention is being drawn <laughs> to your group right now. Yeah. Okay. Alright, Remy, All go right. ahead and open the door. Open this next door. There's Same thing. in here. Same deal. Alright. This next door... I am also gonna open. I was wondering if I was like, if I was like gonna kick it open very dramatically, but then I was like, nah. Let me just like same deal. Let, let me not get it the credit. All right, so they're all they're all just broken bed frames. And as you, you step out and look into this next space, as you move into this open room, as your torch illuminates, you see a door over here, a door over here, another hallway going up here, another hallway over here. Uh, as well as a whole bunch of rubble over here, and what looks like a buried staircase going up. Okay, so there's more doors. There's so, there's what is this more door? You get it? Uh, more doors. You didn't even I let it breathe you. before saying, "Do you Remy get it?" fucking dies. <laughs> oh, Jakey, come on. There could be a better one. <laughs> I'm kidding. I'm going to I'm going to You know what? You guys <laughs> did deserve that pun. Okay? That was that pun was too good for you. All right, Remy, I'm going to go step to this door. further in. And as you do. Oh. There I see things. It is I see time demons. for initiative. I as see them here. <laughs> The shrieking of Morlocks. Oh, I don't like that. It is that. time once again. Uh, is this a perception initiative? Yes, for you it is perception. Oh, cock. They're both. A, they're both before me. There's three. Oh, there's four. You only know about. When have you ever actually don't know about any of them. To go well. You actually don't know about any of them. Uh, <laughs> anime, oh boy. Uh, as this is a sudden surprise attack, uh, oh. Remy, this door bursts open. A Morlock jumps out and just runs right up to you and starts just swinging at you. Um, uh, actually, it scuttles across the floor at you. Um, okay, that's very that's very creepy. Attempts to bite you. Um, that God. Remy is a twenty three to hit. Ah oh, shit! Yep. All right. So I need I need dice. Where are my dice? I haven't had to roll damage yet this session. There we go. That is three points of piercing damage to you, Remy. Uh, okay. And it is then going to continue its movement um, tour down here towards Nyx. Oh, something I com actually completely forgot is that it's also blinded by the torch, um, which means that it will be flat-footed. Um, and then it is going to run at Nyx. Uh, wow. And attempt to uh, bite you as well, Nyx. That is an 18 to hit. No. Alright, then this Morlock just scuttles over <laughs> and just tries to snap at you. Um, Alright, that brings us to Jason. Uh, here are all the shit that's going down. Um, oh, you can see I, you can see yeah. something trying to bite Nyx right now. <laughs> Yeah, considering all the shit that's going down, oh I'll most likely use a stride and run at him first and foremost. Okay. That's all I got. 
to do. And you if the Chrome at loads the Morlock. in. Yeah, I got 30 feet. If you can move me 30 feet at a Morlock, that'd All be right. really I have moved you. I have moved you towards the Morlock and out of the way of your companions. Okay, good. And I so now you are can. also flanking the Morlock that is attacking Nyx, which doesn't really matter since it's flat footed anyways, but yeah. Yes, okay. Fucking game is not loaded real quick. What do you want to do? Uh, I want to double slice and All right. Go <laughs> ahead and roll him. your attacks. All right, double slice. Oh, you also, Let's do this. Uh, wait, double yeah, slice. You, you put your torch down a while ago. Never mind. Yeah, so you've got your dagger. Yeah, out. yeah. Uh, that's going to be 15 to hit. 15 does hit. Oh, yes. Okay, that's the rapier, by the way. Uh, All right. So we, I'll, I'll roll damage. In a second. Nope, nope. Roll roll, oh. Yeah, you got to roll okay. the attacks oh. first. Always attacks first. Uh, Oh, hold on, I just dropped my G6. It's scattered all over the ground. I got it. Okay, okay. Attacks first, attacks first. Uh. Alright, attacks first. Um. G20 for Decker. Uh, that's a 13, that's a 20 to hit. 20 to hit does, in fact, hit. Go ahead and roll okay. damage for both of your attacks. Uh, roll damage first attack. Rapier is with sneak attack. With sneak attack, yeah, go flat-footed. Uh, seven points of damage. And the second attack. attack. Oh, that was uh, just one, one attack. The Hot second damn, attack. All right. Second attack going in. I just quickly dropped another D6. I'm an ad. I suck at this. Uh, that's gonna be five points of damage. Four. Five points four. of damage. All right. Yeah, this Morlock is already bloodied. Okay. Whew. Um. All right. That's that is my the turn. End of Jason's turn. That brings us now to another Morlock over here is going to scuttle around the corner directly up behind Jason. Jason is currently flanked oh. uh, by Morlocks now. Um, and it uh -oh. is going to make its scuttling attack um, as it attempts to stab oh you with gosh. its dagger. Uh, that, that is, is a that nat big. 20. Oh, Thankfully, shit. it is below your level, so it can't get a crit card. Okay. Ha, uh, it just ha. deals double damage. Um, All right. Actually, actually, no. Uh, I don't think it actually does. Oh, you're, are you using your hero point? Yeah. Wait, hold on. What's my, what's my hero card? I, I, don't, I don't have access to it. Uh, yes, you do. Uh, I just have access to the hands. Oh, my hands. Oh, it's, it's, it's Yono's hand. Yes, is, hold on. Yes. <laughs> yes. Spark of courage. Do I have Is this useful? Um, no, I will burn my hero All right, point. Alright, I will roll again. Reroll that shit, Cam. That is, instead of a nat 20, that is a 14. 14 doesn't hit. Alright, it is then going to uh, throw its dagger at Remy. Oh, Grandpa, no! Oh, that, Remy, off. is a 24 to hit. Oh, I hate you so no. very <laughs> much. Uh, Remy, that is three points of piercing damage as a dagger thunks into your back. God damn it. Ow. First I get bit, then I get a, a knife thrown at me. Like, what, the, what is happening to me right now? That it's, is the it's end like, of it's that like, Morlock's turn. Yes. It's like stubbing my toe over and over again. <laughs> Keep forgetting. It's also blinded. Um, I, I feel like that should be included before you roll to it hit. It is, but I mean, hold on, let's see. It beat the DC 11 flat check. It beat the other DC 11 flat check. There we go. So both attacks still do something. Um, God damn it. All right, that brings us now to the next Morlock, who is going do to the scuttle around the corner at Remy again. <laughs> Oh my god, why? Going... <laughs> no, it's check no, to... no 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 do the fucking do the fucking flat check and blind it first. Oh yeah, it's it's getting blinded this time, I've actually remembered. And actually this time, it is blinded by your torch. Um so it does not get its scuttling attack, uh, but it is going to uh wildly swing at you with its dagger. Um that also failed due to the blindness 
Uh, so that Morlock does not get to do anything other than that. Uh, and that brings us to yet Get another up. Morlock who Wait, is no going way. to first and foremost um, take advantage of its swarming stance as it crawls along the ceiling above its Morlock brethren. It is blinded <laughs> Of course. Excuse me, what the fuck? They could do that? Yeah. My um, precious. It oh, does succeed its flat check, and as it scuttles across the ceiling, it is going to make a stab at Jason. Okay. That is a 26 to hit. Oh, that definitely has. And due to your being flat-footed as a result of being flanked, that oh. is a critical hit. Critical. If do if I add two AC, will it prevent <laughs> from being critical? Hit? Yes. Oh, fuck. Wait, wait. As in, like, yes, it will help, or no, it, it will not help? If you increase your AC, then the attack is no longer 10 over. Yes. I will immediately take right. nimble dodge as I... All right. You nimble dodge. And that means that it's sneak attack damage that I forgot for the other Morlock oh, oh. will not be critical. Um, oh, so thank God. The okay. dagger deals three points of uh, three points of piercing plus an additional oh. three points of precision. So you take six, six total damage. points of damage. Ouch. Uh, and it is then going to, uh, while still hanging down from the ceiling, uh, take a chomp at you. Oh, uh, okay. that is a that is an eighteen to hit. Eighteen does hit because I am All flat footed. Right. This is. I'm sorry. Proof. No, it's not flat footed. It's off guard. <laughs> All right, so God. it snaps down Dead. on you with its jaws. That is three points of piercing, plus an additional two points of precision. For five, five total points. points of damage. Ouch! That is the end of its turn. That brings us to Oberyn. Aha! Uh -huh. Alright, can I push my way through? Yes, you can go through your... Al you can move through your allies, you just can't end your turn anymore. Perfect. Alright. Oh, there's a guy right here. Look at that little And there's two there. guys right here. One's on the ceiling, ah, one's on the floor. Oh, oh fuck. wonderful. All right. Um, yeah, I'm going to go ahead and... Uh... And your forget, spell strike moving... is, per is recharged right now. Ah, perfect. Uh, yeah, I'm going to go ahead and spell strike that with All a right. produce flame. All right, go ahead and roll to hit. And I forget, is that a spell casting to hit or a weapon? Uh, it is weapon. You are making a weapon attack. Gotcha. Yeah, spell strike is a weapon attack that you attach your spell's effects to. Gotcha, that's right. All right, 26. 26 does indeed hit. Not only does it hit due to it being blinded, it is crit. So go oh. ahead and uh, deal with that. I believe Produce Flame does have some critical effects. Um, yeah. Uh, it, on a success, deal the fire damage. On a critical success, the target takes double damage and 1d4 oh, persistent God. fire damage. So, uh, your sword is not currently ignited. Um, That's fine. But, go ahead and roll double damage for your sword, uh, as well as double damage for your produced flame, and I will add the persistent fire damage. Uh, okay, so that is 12 points of uh, slashing damage. Hot damn! Plus an Yo. additional... <laughs> Double damage. That's an additional ah, twelve points of fire damage. Twelve points. Hot damn! That is a dead Morlock. <laughs> oh my god! You just roasted him alive. Oh yeah. <laughs> just turns to ash. <laughs> Pretty much. <laughs> Oberyn just walks up behind him, just stabs him through, and just 
the wound cauterizes as the rest of the flesh begins to just light a blaze, and the Morlock just falls to the ground, melting around the Our blade. Orb. Eh. Oh! All right, Ogren, that is the end of your turn. That brings us to Mr. Remy Rattington. I have a question. Is my gun loaded? Yes. Okay, cool. Um, so here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to get into... I'm going to get into Bolt Dancer. All right. No. No, I'm not. Okay. Wait, can I still can I still do an uh, unarmed strike if I'm in Bullet Dancer? No, Bullet Dancer, you can only make attacks with firearms, uh, reinforced stocks, and bayonets. Okay, so I'm not gonna get into Bullet Dancer. What Dragon Dance would allow going... you. Dragon Stance would allow you to make melee and give you more powerful melee attack. Yeah. Um, okay, so here's what I'm gonna do. Mm. I'm going to shoot him with my flintlock. Mm-hmm. Nice. Go ahead and roll the hit. Okay, okay. That is a nat one. <laughs> oh, oh God! Oh fuck. boy! I do Let's... have a hero point. Ah, do which like I will it? be using. Good. Call. All right. All right. Wait, shit! Wrong button. There we go. I am going to re-roll the musket. <laughs> that is a twelve. A twelve. <laughs> that, unfortunately, does not hit. Fair Ooh. enough. What I'm going to do next. I am going to reload my musket with an action. All right. And then I'm going to use an unarmed strike, which does a plus two. Uh, instead do you of want a to do an six. unarmed strike or do you want to do a flurry of blows? Because flurry of blows would be two unarmed do... strikes. Yeah, you know why not? I'll do I'll All do right. a flurry of blows. So that would be the first uh, first unarmed strike is at MAP minus four. Second flurry of blows is at MAP minus eight. So that's a plus two to the first one and a minus two to the second minus one. Minus two to the second, right. 17 to the first. That hits. Go ahead and roll the second one. Excellent. So that is a... Oh, it's, I'll roll damage afterwards. Okay, yeah. so the second one is going to be a 13. A 13, unfortunately, just barely misses. But go ahead okay. and roll damage for that one that you did hit. All right, so that's a 1d4 plus bludgeoning. That is a three. Three points of damage. Yeah. You just boom! Just clock this Morlock right in its right in the kisser. Right in its face. Alright, and that is the end of your turn. That brings us to Nyx. Okay, I'm going to move up here and then I will exploit vulnerabilities. Alright. Or all right. attempt to. Go for it, go for it. That is a 23. 23. Oh yeah, you would recognize that these Morlocks, they look a little bit physically weaker than the ones you fought in the other room. Um, you think they must be some sort of scavengers, especially due to the what you have now noticed is the uh, pile of bones and looks like... Um, it looks like pieces of a a ruined ballista um, oh. all over the floor. Um, a ballista? I, I yes. don't like I don't like what the implications of that are. Um, <laughs> you would know that they uh, like the other Morlocks you've encountered. Um, yeah, they're fast. They can climb. They don't have any specific weaknesses that you are aware of. Um, and uh, it is immune to it looks it says immune to visual so things with a visual trait I would say it is immune to okay. with the exception obviously of bright light they do not like bright light like okay average redditor <laughs> Okay, then I'm going to try to attack the one All on right. the... There's still one on the ceiling right here, Yes, right? there's one on the ceiling, one on the ground. I'm going for the one on the ceiling. All right, go for it. Uh, that is a 16. 16 does hit. Go ahead and roll damage. Hmm. 
Uh, 10 points of damage. 10 points of damage. That Morlock is bloodied. Oh my gosh. And then I will just try to strike again. Alright, go ahead and roll the hit. Um, that's 13. 13, unfortunately, just barely misses. Dookie. Alright then. That brings us to Petra. Alright, well, I'm gonna start by getting into the fucking room. So I feel That'll like that would idea. be helpful. Alright. Where is the one on the ceiling? One on the floor, one on the ceiling, right here. Okay. Um. Nope, I'm not trying to move, I'm trying to measure. Uh. The range on my throwing knife is 20 feet max, right? Not 20 feet minimum? Correct. It's You have a range increment of 20 feet. So okay. you 20 feet with no penalty, and then for every 20 feet beyond that, you get a stacking penalty. Wonderful. I would like to uh, pull out my throwing knife and uh, try and sink it into the gentleman on the ceiling. Go for it. That is a 15. A 15, due to it being blinded and flat-footed? That does hit. Go ahead and roll damage. That is two points of damage. Two points of damage. It is now mortal. That's lovely news. And you know, while I'm at it, I might as well take my other throwing knife and huck it at him. Uh, you may take it from your belt. Then I will take it from my belt. You take it from your belt. That brings us to the top of round two. Uh, that Morlock is dead, so we're on to Jason. <laughs> Rip. There's one on the roof and one on the ground, right? Uh, that is correct. There's one on the roof, one on the ground, and you are no longer flat-footed. Forgot oh, to update okay. that, but yeah, you're not flat-footed anymore. How big are these again? They're smaller than the previous one. Um, they, they're not, like, shorter or anything. They, they look malnourished in okay. comparison to the already malnourished looking things you fought in the other room. <laughs> and there's, how tall is the ceiling? Um, ceiling's only, like, the, the Morlock on the ceiling is only, like, five feet above you. Oh, so it, it's okay. like, it's within melee distance. I don't have to do some bullshit monster hunter style <laughs> no, parkour nothing, to reach him. Nothing oh. crazy here. Mm, damn. Okay, I was looking forward to that. Anyway, I'll attack the one on the ceiling. All right, go for it. Just double slice. Yeah, might as well. <laughs> Just right. in case, right? <laughs> All right, uh, let's do my rapier first. Uh, it's a 23 to hit. 23 does, in fact, hit. Actually, sorry, that's not a 23. That's a 24 to hit, because fucking plus one rapier now. There you go. That, in fact, in that case, crits. Oh, crits. Okay, let me roll yes, that. Yes, due to it being All right. flat-footed. All right, critical gets me a 16 points of damage. He's God mortal, damn. right? He is very dead now. All right. Uh, I just wasted my double slice because he's dead. But I will stick him with my dagger as he falls. All um, right. Okay. <laughs> you stick him with your dagger as he falls. As he falls <laughs> off the ceiling, you just sort of get your dagger right under his spine make sure to sever the spinal cord. So even if he's playing dead, he's not getting up. Yeah, perfect. Uh, and? You have one action remaining. I'm looking at my abilities right now. Let's make sure, make sure I'm not missing anything with this, these rules. Uh, uh, okay, in that case, I'm just gonna stride over here to get Nick some flanking. Right, it is now flanked, and that brings us to the Morlock, who was just flanked, still blinded for the rest of its turn. But at the end of its turn, it will remove its blindness. It is going to first and foremost shriek something out in a language none of you understand. Um, it is then going to. Um, 
it is then going to uh, slash at Jason with its dagger. All right. That is a 27 to hit. 27 does hit. All right. Jason. Almost a crit. But you, oh, take, no. you take six points of piercing damage. Ouch. I am a um, mortal. It is then going to begin scuttling along. And as it, as it does, it scuttles along behind Remy. <gasps> no. Uh, Grandpa. Which means Remy is now flanked as it attempts to chomp down on his thigh. Remy, that is a nine to hit. Uh, for one, I just want to say that I was like zoned out for a half of that, and I for some reason had the Monster Zing song stuck in my head. And actually, the second that you told me the number is when I finished it. So perfect timing. Excellent. And no, a three does not hit. It was a nine, but all right. <laughs> oh, a nine <laughs> also <laughs> does not hit. Um, and. Uh, yeah, that is... It's going to end its turn there as Remy is flanked. Uh, and it is no longer blinded at this point. Um, that brings us now to the other Morlock who is going to take advantage of this flank. Uh, and unfortunately, its attempt to slash at you is thwarted by it still being blinded. Um... And so it is then going to attempt to make one final bite attack against Remy as it goes to scuttle away. Uh, Remy, that is going to be a dirty 20. A dirty 20? Yes. That, that will hit. All right. Remy, you take from that six points. Of wait oh fuck no, off wait hold on there's more six points of piercing from the bite plus sneak attack damage so you take an additional two points of precision damage oh for oh, eight I total hate points you. of damage uh, and it is I'm then mortal. going to is it mortal or bloodied when I'm cut in half uh, bloodied is when you're down in half and then mortal I'm is bloodied it is then going to scuttle all the way over here. To this door um, and it is no longer blinded uh, Damn, Remy you are also no longer flat footed as you are no longer flanked uh, that brings us now to Oberyn aha <clears throat> uh, this one over here is that climbing is no that on a wall? he's on the floor there? he's on the floor ah gotcha all right I'm just gonna step around excuse me pardon me <laughs> And uh, I'm going to... Actually, first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to set my sword on fire. All right, you set your sword on fire. Yippee. You have one uh, action remaining. And then I'm going to hit it with my now burning sword. All right, all right. That is a 29. 29. Actually, that, that's oh a natural God. 20. Hot natural damn. 20 plus Let 9. Shit. Roll you that crit hit card. That man is not okay. <laughs> Over to Mr. Colby. Random. You've gotten crit card number 55. That was a slashing attack. From chops to groin. Triple oh. damage. And the target must succeed at a fortitude save or die. Oh my God. Oh, oh, he got the this card. Before. This is a different one. This is a different card with a similar effect. This is the slashing wow. version of that effect. Oh my god. Okay. Uh, so do I do I roll once and then triple that, or do I roll three times? Roll once and then triple that, but it doesn't matter. It failed its fortitude save. Oh. So. Uh, that's twenty-one points. Twenty-one points of damage. Even if you did, even if it didn't fail the fortitude save, it was dead in one hit. As Oberon just. Whoo, lights the blade up the thing barely has time to turn around and just ah, as just whoosh, two pieces falling on either side dead you there's only got some one guns on my warlock shoe. remaining in this That's room my shoe. that brings us now oh where did you go you moved um that brings us now to mr remy raddington 
Okay, so check it out. I'm going to get into Bullet Dancer. Yeah. Okay, so I'm in Bullet Dancer. Then I'm going to shoot him and reload in the same action because I can do that. All right. Uh, yeah. Um, it does have cover currently there. due to Jason being in the way. Ugh. Um, okay. Uh, Jason, duck. <laughs> <laughs> that makes no oh. difference. Go ahead and roll it. All right. Jakey, don't kill my that's character. A, um, that's a 17, and I hate you. Um, <laughs> 17 <laughs> does, in fact, normally hit, but it does not due to Jason giving it cover. Fuck! So. What the hell? I would say that okay. in this scenario, you hit the cover. What? Actually, I'm okay with that. Yeah, I was going to say, this This is Jason, <laughs> so go ahead and roll damage. <laughs> oh, fuck. Can I nibble dodge my way out of this? Okay. Yeah, I would oh say... Oh my god, the what? <laughs> I would say I'll that... six points! <laughs> since Jason has not used his nimble dodge this turn, yeah. this round, then he can nimble dodge out of this. So okay, fair enough. He All does right. not get hit by that. But Remy, I you just like I hear it. Fired I, I, and reloaded. I, I I have the hairs of the back of my neck stand up. I turn around. <laughs> Remy's and I just see, shooting like, at you. Remy aiming at me. I'm like, <gasps> boosh, you and duck, like, and you know that just the bullet would have gone straight into your noggin if you hadn't. Ducked. I know. I just uh, like look at Remy. I just like middle fucking finger for Remy, my dagger. You, you have one action remaining. Okay, well now knowing that a 17 doesn't hit and the only action or and the only thing that I can do at that point is a plus one instead of a plus six, I'm just gonna yeah, wait. over here so that he's no. not in my way. Wait, no no no, hold on, you can totally do it again. You just need to get a natural natural twenty and you totally get it. <laughs> yeah, uh do, do you do you want that risk? Because I'm pretty sure if I get any lower than like <laughs> than like an eighteen, it's gonna hit you. <laughs> You're gonna roll a natural twenty on this roll. Roll it. Nah, what he already moved. Roll oh, it fuck. Okay. Okay. Nix. okay, I'm going to... 15, 20, and try to attack. Don't get in front of me! Go ahead and roll to hit. I'm not sure. She's, she's kept herself out of your line of fire. Don't worry. Good. 15? <laughs> 15, Wise. unfortunately, just barely misses. Okay, try again. All right, go ahead. No. I miss no. again. <laughs> Out I miss again. Yes. What did oh. you get? It was a 13. Oh, unfortunate. All right, then. That brings us to Petra. Okay, we're gonna start by moving. All right. Then I'm gonna <laughs> huck that dagger I prepared at him. Okay, that is just barely within range increment. So go ahead and roll the hit. That is a sixteen to hit. Sixteen does just barely hit. I try to ask you to get out of my way. <laughs> That is two points of damage. Two points of damage, all right. And I still have an action remaining, so I'm just going to move over. Not that far. Why was it doing that to me? I blame your trackpad. Well, that makes sense. I'm going to move there so I don't all get right, shot by our blood-hungry rat man. As you do, you would notice <laughs> a set of double doors right here. Wonderful. Right. Love a set of double doors. That brings us around to the top of round three. Jason, you're up. Uh, I am actually really hurt right now. Fuck it, let's go at it. And I'm gonna just stride, rush in. Make sure you get out of my way. I <laughs> don't, I because I'm double slicing you. this <laughs> thing. Go ahead and no, wait, 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 wait. Okay, yeah, if I'm gonna get out of the way, because I almost got fucking shot. So here, I'll double right. slice him here. <laughs> go ahead and double slice. <laughs> All right, rapier attack going in. That's gonna be, uh, that definitely does not hit a 12. A 12 does not hit. No, sorry. 13. Cause it's a 13 plus still eight. does yeah. not hit. All right. Dagger here coming in. Dagger not. Here. Okay. 
All right, that's gonna be uh oh, it's not good either. Wait, it's yeah, it's not good either. It's a twelve. Twelve also does 12. not hit. All right, that's my turn. That brings us now to this Morlock, who is going to look around frantically, just hey uh, ha, and it's going to swipe at Jason with its dagger. Oh. I'm so screwed. Uh, Jason, that is a dirty 20. A dirty 20. It does hit. All right. That is... I'm dead. Six <laughs> points of oh, slashing damage. I am critically mortal. Scuttles oh, no. away to over here. And as its final action, it's going to open that door. And that is all it can do with its turn. That brings us to Oberyn. All right. Uh, for this guy, I'm just going to go ahead and cast uh, Dimensional Assault. All right, all right. Or Telekinetic Assault. I Telekinetic Projectile, I mean. Okay. I can't cast Dimensional Assault right now. All right. Once this combat is over, if people need to heal, you should remember to take the refocus action to restore your focus point so that you can oh, use that again. Uh, yeah, but I'm going to go ahead and actually wait. That's a... Wait, where did it go? Feet. It went around the corner from you. Oh. Uh, yeah, okay. I'm going to move forward a little bit. And then I'm gonna uh, projectile. I'm gonna, right. uh, I'd say, pick up a uh, sharp rock. Actually, you know what? Do I have a dagger? I'm gonna use my throwing knife. <laughs> All right. I'm gonna shoot it at him. All right. Are you using your telekinetic projectile to throw the throwing knife at him? Yes. Of course. All right. Go ahead and roll the hit. 22. 22 does, in fact, hit. Go ahead and roll damage. That's five points of piercing damage. Five points of piercing damage. The Morlock is bloodied, but still alive. I believe and that's then, the end of your turn as you have moved I on the so. projectile. So that brings that's us correct. to Mr. Remy Raddington. The Morlock has gone around the corner. Okay, so I'm going to move right here. Or actually, right. right here. Either way, that's fine. Uh, I'm going to shoot it with the musket. You shoot at it with the musket. Go ahead and roll to hit. There's a 13, 13 shite. I'm in Bullet Dancer, so that reloads that the gun as well. That does not hit, but yes, the gun is reloaded. I'm going to shoot at it again. All right, go ahead and roll to hit. That is a nat 20. A nat oh. 20. Hot damn, my son. All right, let me deal with it. Wow. Me deal there, with there have been quite a few nat 20s guy. today. God damn. I have. Don't it say that. Shut luck. the fuck up. Do not mention All right. it. <laughs> Mr. Jacob Perez, that is crit card number 54. That, uh, all right. Uh, oh god, you got this card again. Do you want bludgeoning you or serious? piercing? Do you want bludgeoning or piercing? It's either, I it's mean, either I guess the bludgeoning, triple... right? All right, yeah. Go ahead and the, roll the target damage. must succeed a fortitude save or die. Go ahead and god roll. God damn, I got that card again. What the fuck? <laughs> okay, roll damage. Five times three. That is fifteen points of damage. Fifteen points of damage, which is thankfully just enough to kill it because it succeeded its fortitude save. But it is okay, dead cool. either way so, as the shot whoa, rings whoa, out. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Let, like me, let me say how I want to kill. Wait, I want to ask. I want to ask. Yes. I want to ask. Can I roll a nature save? Because I want to make this very specific for some reason. You can just make it very specific. Okay, so I'm going to shoot this thing in whatever its anatomical equivalent of a femoral artery is. So that it is, it out on well, the floor. It, is a, it, it is a human. <laughs> it so, literally is a human. Uh, it is technically a human, so you shoot it in its femoral okay, artery. Okay, I didn't realize that, so I just shot it in the femoral artery. You and I'm shoot it in the femoral the artery, and it just collapses to the ground and just rapidly bleeds out on the floor as the shot and the, the, the just pained moans go through the air i don't know why i wanted to make that so specific but i don't know okay, either there we go either uh, way <laughs> um 
All of you other than Petra get 120 XP. Petra, you get 60. Damn. How much do the rest of us get? 120. And uh, Colby, don't forget to update your XP from the previous uh, the previous encounter, because you got 80 from the previous encounter. Aha! That puts me over 1,000. Indeed it does. I'm level 3. How many, how many points again, sorry? 120. 120, okay, got it. Oh yes. my gosh, you're an asshole. <laughs> and that is where we're going to take our break.